Chases already know I hate Kimwin with like a passion. Wow. Because uh, the <laughs> the facility, they just were not on point with their queerness, and they would they did a lot of things that were technically illegal, and it just made me really uncomfortable with being queer there. So I was like, peace. I'm going to Latin on the north side because I can be my full queer self. <laughs> raised in Chicago but I've never been able to afford to live on the lakefront and I would like to live on the lakefront and go outside and walk on the, <laughs> by the water in the morning or in the night or whatever but it's so damn expensive to live on the lakefront so I'm right here on the lake because <laughs> this is where I wish I could be. <laughs> okay well that concludes our game. Teenagers!
We do What is your favorite thing about you media? How random everybody is. How yeah, random everybody random. is. I said, like, one day you just come in, if someone like brought... Bro, I was song. literally sitting... Yeah, was, yeah, everybody, everybody else is screaming I with love me. You. We break out a song and dance every day. I, I swear. That. It's like High School Musical, but... So, do y'all know the game Two Truths and a Lie? Yeah? Okay, so you're doing Two Truths and a Lie. Okay, I have Two Truths and a Lie. When Marcus is my friend, <laughs> we had alligators in our waters. There's a McDonald's near me. Oh, my, my name is Lamarcus. I'm really bad at piano, just saying. Take one. Aye! Aye! It's really broad in general. It, the, the prompt is to make a piece that shares what you would want people to know about your Chicago. And defining your Chicago however you want. So, like, your Chicago can be your block, it can be your home, it can be your arts group, it can be your school, it can be your family, it can be however you define community. It's only roughly for kids, you know, to be off the streets. And I feel like our neighborhoods, especially, like, I'll be part of self track. We're all in every different neighborhood. We're trying to find ways to keep the kids off the streets. Chicago to me is this building up from the ground from nothing. Um, whether that is for a negative or a positive reason, I mean, there's a lot of building that goes on in Chicago that goes from the activism we do, super grassroots, to how people make the most amount of money. So it's a good and bad thing, but that is what Chicago means to me. Hot dogs, Hot dogs. the six rings, Whoa. the bus, the bus. The bus. Get on the bus. Get on. I'm from Boston. <laughs> Get on the bus. Oh. My Chicago is. Full of jazz and music. Go, 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 go. Lost in the voice. You're getting lost in the like rest of the neighborhood. But if I like put her in line, then you pop out like right after that. Yeah, he's so like, like oh, there's yeah. nothing to do it. And yeah. I like, I go, I'm like break from my house. Hey, and then you just run oh, off. Yeah. Undercover. Okay. Undercover. Okay, so did you learn anything new today? Yes. Yeah. I I learned a lot more from. I'm gonna edit that out. <laughs> I learned about um, different the different types of communities and how the diff like there are different perspectives of neighborhoods, and we may see one part of the neighborhood in our eyes, but people also see a different point of view from it. Ralph, I was gonna put that in the bloopers. Very salty. <laughs> Ralph yeah. Alpha.
Okay. Chicago. Welcome, Welcome to our Chicago. Welcome to our Chicago. 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 Chic